All right guys, I have got some really exciting news for you today. So if you're a fan of the channel, you'll know that we've done a bunch of videos from here at Lancaster University in the physics lab. Well, we are now partnering with the biomedical physics group at Lancaster University to produce a groundbreaking device which will provide early diagnosis of dementia using neurovascular oscillatory phase coherence. And we'll be able to produce this device for less than the cost of two months electricity of an MRI machine, which is currently the only way to diagnose dementia. And we want you guys to get involved. Currently, diagnosing dementia is a long multi-step process involving a clinical assessment and either an MRI or CT brain scan. Now because of the cost and complexity of MRI, it means it's only available in specialist locations like hospitals. And that means that the wait time for a diagnosis for dementia can be very long, sometimes more than a year. Whilst no one enjoys getting an MRI scan, it can be particularly difficult or even impossible for certain groups of vulnerable people, meaning this device would be a game-changing solution. Now there's no cure for dementia, or at least not yet. But what we do know is that if people get a diagnosis early enough, they can receive treatment which will significantly delay the onset of symptoms. And that means people get more quality time with friends and loved ones. Now we can make this a reality with our device. It is a simple wearable cap, would be a fraction of the cost of an MRI, could be used by a trained nurse in a doctor's surgery or even at home, and has the potential to massively reduce wait lists down to almost zero. Now we are lucky enough to be filming this in the UK where access to diagnosis by MRI is at least possible. But for hundreds of millions of people on earth, that's not their reality. So our device could make diagnosis of dementia possible for everyone. We're gonna tell you a bit about our device, but first, how can you get involved? This project is the culmination of decades of research by Professor Aneta Stefanowska and her biomedical physics research group. Now we're at the exciting point of time of being able to make this device a commercial reality and bring all of those positive changes to people that we've discussed. Now we need seed investors to help us get this over the line. So if you would like to help us change the world and make a great return on investment while doing so, please check out the link in the description below to find out how you can get involved. The opportunity is open to everyone, so we would love to hear from you. Now, we're gonna hear from Sam in the lab, who will tell us a bit about how it works. The device consists of three steps, measuring the data, processing the data, and a user interface. The brain signals are measured via the cap, where EEG measures the neuronal activity, while FNERS, or Functional Near Infrared Spectroscopy, measures brain oxygenation. Additionally, the heart rate is measured via ECG, while respiration rate is measured using a respiration belt. Following data collection, inbuilt algorithms evaluate the strength and coordination between cardiorespiratory and neurovascular oscillations. These are based on the state-of-the-art time frequency analysis approaches developed here at Lancaster University. We hope you find the prospect of making this device a reality as exciting as we do. We'd love you to join us on this journey. Click the link in the description to find out more and thank you for watching. We hope to hear from you soon. <laughs>